Good morning! I just woke up. I'm having some coffee. I'm making a, the last time I made this, you guys said it was a poor man's mocha. So that's what I'm having. <laughs> it is a package of like hot chocolate that I mixed into my coffee. So I haven't mixed it in yet actually, that's a lie. I'm going to mix it into my coffee. So this morning I have a lot of stuff to do. I need to do so many things. I have to mow the backyard. Let me show you the yard. It is uh, pretty overgrown. All this rain has made it grow like so fast. So this is, I haven't mowed the yard for a week. This is a week's worth of growth. It's crazy. Check it out. It's pretty tall. Oh yeah, got the lawnmower out. And I think I'm gonna set up the camera right here. That would be the like, what it would show. I think that's a pretty good angle to show you guys me mowing the lawn real quick. Okay, so I totally meant to set up the camera while I was mowing the lawn and I started listening to Carly Rae Jepsen and forgot to set up the camera. So I'm gonna set it up now. <laughs> dogs are very happy that the grass is finally mowed so that is good it took me a long time to do it though because of the rain I can't remember if I said this already but because it was raining every day I can't mow the grass when it's wet or I guess you can but you're not really supposed to but I have been listening to Carly Rae Jepsen while I've been mowing the lawn and I didn't realize that Tim I, a I didn't realize that Tim got Amazon Prime um, so I guess we get Amazon music now included with that which is love it I love it B I didn't realize how much I loved Carly Rae Jepsen <laughs> like I knew that I loved a few of her songs a lot but I just listened to the whole emotion album while I was cleaning outside here and um, mowing the lawn and stuff I love it I love it why isn't she more popular like what the heck also somebody did tell me that she was mean I tweeted about it the other day because I a song came on while we were doing the coke taste test which i'll put in the description down below if you guys want to watch that that was fun um but yeah i they said that she was mean like pushing people out of the way when they were trying to get a picture with her so that i don't like that kind of makes me feel like mm, but i really like her music i'm so torn i'm conflicted oh my god i was changing after mowing the lawn and this was in my hair Look at this bug. <sighs> what the heck? I, I was just, I kept brushing my hair away. Like, I don't even know. Like, I'm not, I'm not thinking there was something in my hair. And there was definitely this bug all up in my hair. So, cool. So today's dinner will be a HelloFresh meal. We're gonna have the Monterey Jack burger. I was excited to try this one because it says that this is the burger that tops all burgers. All is in all caps. So, this better be a pretty darn good burger. I mean, like, they hyped it up pretty crazy right there, so I'm excited for this one. So right now, I'm just kind of, like, getting everything together so I can start prepping stuff. I'm gonna read these directions, like, 900 times because they are always confusing. But yeah, so let's get started. So I've already started quartering my zucchini, and I started slicing my onions in just, like, thin slices because we're gonna make this into, like, an onion marmalade with some balsamic in there so yeah it's kind of cool so now i have my onions caramelizing they've been cooking for like six minutes i'm gonna cook them for maybe like another two minutes i want to get them nice and kind of like a dark color i have minced up my garlic and somebody actually tweeted me about this thing that i use to mince my garlic this was a gift but i wanted to at least show you like the brand name so that you could find it if you wanted to but it's awesome you can use it for garlic and shallots and like it's it's great all right tim called me so i finished making the um onion jam while i was on the phone with him but i wanted to show it to you 
it looks very gross. I cooked the onions that you saw earlier, I just cooked them in a tablespoon of balsamic vinegar and I don't have sugar, but it called for a teaspoon of sugar. I used honey, I don't know how well that's gonna turn out, but, um, and then just a little salt and pepper. I also made my garlic aioli, which was two tablespoons of mayonnaise, like a quarter of a teaspoon of this minced garlic, and then some salt and pepper. So now I'm gonna make the zucchini fries. So basically I'm going to toss these in this with a little panko breadcrumb and oregano. And then those are gonna go in the oven at 450 for like 15 minutes. So yeah, I'm kind of excited. These sound like they might be pretty good. Although I don't really know about heating up the mayonnaise. That seems very counterintuitive to me. And here are my zucchini fries. They're ready to go in the oven. I'm gonna put mine in the toaster oven this time and hopefully they don't get too cooked. I know sometimes the toaster oven can kind of like cook them quicker, so. But I also think it might make them a little bit crispier, which I kind of want. So going in there for, I'm gonna say 12 minutes to start. But I've got my burgers ready to go in the pan. So, okay, all right. I think I need to put the heat up a little bit. Medium high, crap. All right, I, I put the heat up to medium high because that's what it was supposed to be on. So, whoops, my bad. So it wanted me to flip these and that's kind of like not really a thing that can happen because everything just falls off of them. This is pretty intense, you guys. That stuff is really frying. But yeah, so these are gonna go in for another six minutes. All right, so I've added the cheese. We're gonna let that kind of melt down a little bit there in the pan. And now I, I made a little bit more of the garlic aioli because I think I put a little bit too much on the zucchini fries. So I had to make a little bit more. Here is the outcome. The burger itself actually looks pretty good. I, I need to learn how to like smoosh it down to fit the bun size because I definitely am not very good at that but I added some of the balsamic onion reduction and it actually, it tastes pretty good. I think the honey gave it like a really nice flavor. So I put a little ketchup on there. That is the burger. And then here is the zucchini kind of like a little fry thing that we tried to do there. I don't know if that really turned out, but yeah, that's dinner. All right, so I'm waiting for Tim to get home and I had a couple of bites of my burger. Well, I ate half my burger. <laughs> um, it's a little undercooked. I would have liked to it have all been the color on the right there, but this is a really good burger. I am not gonna lie. I didn't think this burger was gonna be very good because I didn't really like the idea of the onions and the balsamic. I was kind of like, oh, about that. On its own, the onion and balsamic was kind of gross, but the burger together as a whole is so good. Like, this is really good. I don't know why I do this. I always think like, mm, I'm not gonna like it. I'm definitely gonna hate it. I don't even wanna eat it. And then I end up loving it. So it's surprisingly good. So yay, thumbs up for me. And then Tim will be home soon. Hopefully he had to work a little bit late, but I'll let you know what he thinks too. Hopefully he likes it. Happy Thursday, everybody. I'm home now, finally. It was a long day at work. It's just starting to rain outside, like thunder is happening. And I just finished that meal, that burger. Holy cow. That burger was so good. And those like, what, zucchini fries, I guess, were delicious with the garlic aioli. Wow, I can't believe how good that was. I would like to eat more of it uh, right now. I wanna eat all of it, <laughs> but it, there's none left. I ate it all. 100% open and honest conversation with you guys. I just spent entirely too much time watching weird music videos on YouTube. It was fun though. Good morning, it is the very next day and we forgot to film an outro. So I was just having some coffee and I figured I would film an outro really quick. So I'm sorry that we didn't film this yesterday. Um, we didn't do much after Tim watched the music videos. I don't even know where he found these music videos. I think one of you guys tweeted them at him. I'm not totally sure, but he was like engrossed in a black hole of weird music videos for like hours yesterday, so. Sorry that the video was kind of funky at the end there. So I hope you guys liked the video and um, this weekend we have some really fun stuff planned. Very excited for that. We did, did a little bit of planning as well last night where we just kind of figured out when we're gonna try to do what. They're all very tentative plans based on the weather and the dogs and things like that. Still not 100% sure when we're doing stuff, but we have like a ballpark idea now, which makes me feel a little bit better. Uh, so yeah, so thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price.